we invite you to peruse Claremont Rug Company's incredible collection of rare 19th century Caucasian art rugs in all sizes from mats to 6x12. Caucasian rugs, as well as Persian tribal weavings, were created by only one artisan or a small family unit that cared for the sheep, dyed, spun, and wove. For this reason, they are particularly individual expressions and the best of these rugs are extraordinary works of folk art. Caucasian weavers depended on their flocks of sheep for the wool they used. They harvested plant-based materials for their dyes. A majority of antique Caucasian rugs are made entirely from hand-spun wool, the knotted pile, warp and weft. An exception is found in Shirvan rugs which use a distinct cotton weft and selvage. Over generations, each village or weaving district developed its own specific designs, which became the weaver's unique signature. These designs aid us in identifying the origin of each weaving and include eagle and cloud band motifs, archaic birds, dragons, the ram's horn, peacock, and many more. Caucasian carpets were woven mainly in smaller area sizes, although some regions produced runners and larger flat weaves. The weavers, out of necessity, used smaller looms, which aided their annual migrations or could fit easily into compact living quarters. Natural dyes were culled from plants, herbs, minerals, insects, and mollusks. The colors most often seen in naturally dyed antique Caucasian rugs range from brilliant and glowing to muted and neutral. The ivory was from undyed wool. Red tones were wrought from the root of the matter plant, which varied in shade from light tangerine to deep rich reds or even magenta. Walnut husks and volcanic soil were used to produce brown. Undyed brown sheep's wool or camel hair were sometimes used, making for a unique addition to the color palette. Black evolved from brown wool over dyed with indigo. This process often creates a corrosive result, which oxidizes the wool over time. The indigo plant was the main source for blue tones, varied to produce literally every shade of blue, from a light powder blue to deep midnight indigo. The cochineal beetle produced a luminous crimson dye prized by collectors. Rare Tyrian purple was obtained from shellfish. Varying shades of yellow were produced from pear leaves, chamomile, onion skins, turmeric, and buckhorn berries with a particularly rich golden tone from the precious spice saffron. Most greens were obtained from first dyeing the wool with indigo and then over dyeing it with a yellow dye stuff. Natural dyes also yielded the sought after color variations known as abrash. Antique Caucasian rugs remain some of the most admired and collected works of art today. By adhering to their age old traditions of weaving and embracing ancient symbols and meaningful pattern language, the weavers have created something precious that can withstand the passage of time. From the simplest looms and natural materials, the Caucasian rug panoply remains a testament to the unfettered human spirit. Since 1980, Claremont Rug Company's niche has been the finest in authentic, art-level antique carpets for today's collectors and for home decoration. Browse a sampling of more than 1,000 antique Persian and Caucasian carpets at ClaremontRug.com.